I can see charismatic pastors out there saying, all you need is a touch for, from the Holy Spirit, <laughs> and you don't need this apologetic intellectual life. Yeah. What would you say to that person? First of all, if there wasn't a devil yeah. and there wasn't falsehood and deception, I'd say, sure. However, <laughs> there is a devil, there, and he is the deceiver. He's disguised as an angel of light, the scripture says. So we have to understand that because there is evil in the universe and that evil uses deception and lies, he's the father of lies. Therefore, there's no way in the world that we can just trust our, our impressions Sure. to be the only guide. Now, I believe that Holy Spirit speaks to us. I believe that he's at work to guide us into all truth. However, there's a subjective reality that ultimately is, is, is vulnerable without the clear guidance of the Word of God and the guidance of Christian philosophers who have taken the Word of God and now apply it in contrast to the God of this age.